Hey folks, Sudhir here, your host from Coinsutra.com. Just wanted to make a quick video on a very important concept of Ethereum. I think many of you who have transacted in Ethereum and Ethereum tokens must have felt and faced this issue many times when it says that your transaction has failed because of less gas or it is out of gas basically. So it looks like something like this when a transaction gets failed on the Ethereum blockchain due to the less gas figure and I just wanted to make a quick video and tell you that why this gas matters and what it is actually and uh, I have already done a detailed detailed write up on ethereum gas gas limit and gas prices which i will link below in this video so you can check it out for yourself and to tell you in short that what gas and gas limit and gas price actually means i will just read out and tell you that what it is meant for so basically these two factors gas limit and gas price helps in determining the transaction fees on the ethereum blockchain so if you scroll down just in my article you will see the gas limit is nothing but something which is used as a fuel to run that particular smart contract so that that operation is completed and the price that you pay for that fuel is measured in gas price which is in GUI and uh, I will tell you a tool which you can always use as a reference so that in future your none of the transactions will fail so let us see that tool so this tool is available on the website ETH gas station so basically this uh, website is not developed by ethereum development team but there are some ethereum guys who really like this project they have developed this tool you can use ETH gas station tool to measure how much gas price and gas limit you should pay and you can see that in what time your transaction will go through so go to this website and go to transaction calculator and here you can see that you can put the gas used and gas price and get an approximate prediction that how much time and how much blocks and how much fees basically in fiat and ether you would be paid so let's suppose if i put 21000 as gas used and if i select the fastest fees which is 30 GUI and submit. So here I can see at the right hand side that uh, the probability of my transaction getting accepted is 100% and the mean time in which it will be accepted is 25 seconds and I will get a confirmation in maximum two blocks I have to wait and the transaction fee which will be equivalent this much in ETH and this much in fiat basically in dollars and you can change your currency also here in Euro GBP in Chinese Yuan whatever you want and for for example, let's suppose I change this gas used to 30,000 and uh, here I am selecting other and I am selecting here gas price is 50 GUI and submitting then also I can see that how much time and how much block and how much fiat fee I will be paying. So I would recommend that not to pay too much fees and always use this kind of prediction tools. For example, let's say if you are putting less than 30 GUI. So let's suppose we put 20 GUI and see how much fees it will be deducting from your ETH balance and how much time it will be taking. So you see that there is a chances of 94% your transaction will get through and uh, hardly you will need to wait 25 seconds and mean block time would be two blocks and if i put even less 10 gui so you can see that uh, the gas price and the percentage would be 89 and the mean confirmation time has not really changed and the fiat fee has decreased so this is a good tool to quickly check whether the right gas is paid or not and right gas limit is used or not. I will put the link of this tool and my tutorial in the description section of this video. Feel free to check it for yourself and that's all from my side and I will be back soon with a new video tutorial from Coinsutra. Bye bye. <laughs>